Three-dimensional space, also three space or rarely tri-dimensional space, is a geometric setting in which three values called parameters are required to determine the position of an element, i.e., point. This is the informal meaning of the term dimension. In physics and mathematics, a sequence of n numbers can be understood as a location in n-dimensional space. When n equals 3, the set of all such locations is called three-dimensional Euclidean space. It is commonly represented by the symbol 3. This serves as a three-parameter model of the physical universe that is, the spatial part, without considering time in which all known matter exists. However, this space is only one example of a large variety of spaces in three dimensions called three manifolds. In this classical example, when the three values refer to measurements in different directions coordinates, any three directions can be chosen, provided that vectors in these directions do not all lie in the same two-space plane. Furthermore, in this case, these three values can be labeled by any combination of three chosen from the terms width, height, depth, and length. In Euclidean geometry Coordinate systems In mathematics, analytic geometry also called Cartesian geometry describes every point in three-dimensional space by means of three coordinates. Three coordinate axes are given, each perpendicular to the other two at the origin, the point at which they cross. They are usually labeled x, y, and z. Relative to these axes, the position of any point in three-dimensional space is given by an ordered triple of real numbers, each number giving the distance of that point from the origin measured along the given axis, which is equal to the distance of that point from the plane determined by the other two axes. Other popular methods of describing the location of a point in three-dimensional space include cylindrical coordinates and spherical coordinates, though there are an infinite number of possible methods. See Euclidean space. Below are images of the above mentioned systems. Topic: <laughs> Lines and planes. Two distinct points always determine a straight line. Three distinct points are either collinear or determine a unique plane. Four distinct points can either be collinear, coplanar or determine the entire space. Two distinct lines can either intersect, be parallel or be skew. Two parallel lines, or two intersecting lines, lie in a unique plane, so skew lines are lines that do not meet and do not lie in a common plane. Two distinct planes can either meet in a common line or are parallel do not meet. Three distinct planes, no pair of which are parallel, can either meet in a common line, meet in a unique common point or have no point in common. In the last case, the three lines of intersection of each pair of planes are mutually parallel. A line can lie in a given plane, intersect that plane in a unique point or be parallel to the plane. In the last case, there will be lines in the plane that are parallel to the given line. A hyperplane is a subspace of one dimension less than the dimension of the full space. The hyperplanes of a three-dimensional space are the two-dimensional subspaces, that is, the planes. In terms of Cartesian coordinates, the points of a hyperplane satisfy a single linear equation, so planes in this three-space are described by linear equations. A line can be described by a pair of independent linear equations, each representing a plane having this line as a common intersection. Varignon's theorem states that the midpoints of any quadrilateral in 3 form a parallelogram, and so, are coplanar. <laughs> Spheres and balls 
A sphere in three space, also called a two sphere because it is a two-dimensional object, consists of the set of all points in three space at a fixed distance r from a central point p. The solid enclosed by the sphere is called a ball, or more precisely, a three-ball. The volume of the ball is given by v equals four three pi r. 3 display style v equals frac 4 3 pi r caret 3 another type of sphere arises from a four ball whose three dimensional surface is the three sphere points equidistant to the origin of the euclidean space 4 if a point has coordinates p x y z w then x2 plus y2 plus z2 plus w2 equals 1 characterizes those points on the unit 3 sphere centered at the origin equals topic polytopes equals in 3 dimensions there are 9 regular polytopes the 5 convex platonic solids and the 4 non-convex kepler poinsot polyhedra equals topic surfaces of revolution equals a surface generated by revolving a plane curve about a fixed line in its plane as an axis is called a surface of revolution the plane curve is called the generatrix of the surface a section of the surface, made by intersecting the surface with a plane that is perpendicular orthogonal to the axis, is a circle. Simple examples occur when the generatrix is a line. If the generatrix line intersects the axis line, the surface of revolution is a right circular cone with vertex apex the point of intersection. However, if the generatrix and axis are parallel, the surface of revolution is a circular cylinder. Quadric surfaces In analogy with the conic sections, the set of points whose Cartesian coordinates satisfy the general equation of the second degree, namely a x 2 plus b y 2 plus c Z two plus F X Y plus G Y Z plus H X Z plus J X plus K Y plus L Z plus M equals zero Display style x carrot two plus by carrot two plus c z carrot two plus f x e plus geese plus h x z plus j x plus key plus l z plus m equals zero where a, b, c, f, g, h, j, k, l and m are real numbers and not all of a, b, c, f, g and h are zero is called a quadric surface. There are six types of non-degenerate quadric surfaces. Ellipsoid Hyperboloid of one sheet Hyperboloid of two sheets Elliptic cone Elliptic paraboloid Hyperbolic paraboloid The degenerate quadric surfaces are the empty set, a single point, a single line, a single plane, a pair of planes or a quadratic cylinder a surface consisting of a non-degenerate conic section in a plane π and all the lines of 3 through that conic that are normal to π. Elliptic cones are sometimes considered to be degenerate quadric surfaces as well. 
Both the hyperboloid of one sheet and the hyperbolic paraboloid are ruled surfaces, meaning that they can be made up from a family of straight lines. In fact, each has two families of generating lines, the members of each family are disjoint and each member one family intersects, with just one exception, every member of the other family. Each family is called a regulus. In linear algebra Another way of viewing three-dimensional space is found in linear algebra, where the idea of independence is crucial. Space has three dimensions because the length of a box is independent of its width or breadth. In the technical language of linear algebra, space is three-dimensional because every point in space can be described by a linear combination of three independent vectors. <laughs> Dot product, angle, and length A vector can be pictured as an arrow. The vector's magnitude is its length, and its direction is the direction the arrow points. A vector in 3 can be represented by an ordered triple of real numbers. These numbers are called the components of the vector. The dot product of two vectors a a1, a2, a3 and b B1, B2, B3 is defined as a B equals a 1 B 1 plus a 2 B 2 plus a 3 B 3 Display style math bf a c d o t math bf b equals a underscore one b underscore one plus a underscore two b underscore two plus a underscore three b underscore three. The magnitude of a vector a is denoted by a. The dot product of a vector a equals a one a two a three with itself as a a equals Two equals a one two plus a two two plus a three two Display style Math BF a C D O T Math BF a equals Math BF a carrot two equals A underscore one carrot two plus A underscore two carrot two plus A underscore three carrot two which gives O equals O O equals O one two plus a 2 2 plus a 3 2 display style math bf a equals sqrt math bf a c d o t math bf a equals sqrt a underscore 1 caret 2 plus a underscore 2 caret 2 plus a underscore 3 caret 2 the formula for the Euclidean length of the vector. Without reference to the components of the vectors, the dot product of two non-zero Euclidean vectors a and b is given by a b equals a b cos theta. Display style math bf a c d o t math bf b equals math bf a math bf b cos theta, where theta is the angle between a and b. Topic cross product. 
The cross product or vector product is a binary operation on two vectors in three dimensional space and is denoted by the symbol times. The cross product A times B of the vectors A and B is a vector that is perpendicular to both and therefore normal to the plane containing them. It has many applications in mathematics, physics, and engineering. The space and product form an algebra over a field, which is neither commutative nor associative, but is a Lie algebra with the cross product being the Lie bracket. One can in n dimensions take the product of n1 vectors to produce a vector perpendicular to all of them. But if the product is limited to non-trivial binary products with vector results, it exists only in 3 and 7 dimensions. In calculus Topic: Gradient, divergence, and curl. In a rectangular coordinate system, the gradient is given by f equals f x i plus f y j plus f z. K display style nabla f equals frac partial f partial x math bf i plus frac partial f partial y math bf j plus frac partial f partial z math bf k the divergence of a continuously differentiable vector field f equals u i plus v j plus w k is equal to the scalar valued function. Div f equals f equals u x plus v y plus w z Display style operator name div math bff equals nabla c d o t math bff equals frac partial u partial x plus frac partial v partial y plus frac partial w partial z. Expanded in Cartesian coordinates, see del in cylindrical and spherical coordinates for spherical and cylindrical coordinate representations. The curl times f is for f composed of f x, f y, f z, i j k x y z f x f y f z. Display style begin v matrix math b f i end math b f j end math b f k f r a c partial partial x and f r a c partial partial y and frac partial partial z f underscore x and f underscore y and f underscore z end v matrix where i j and k are the unit vectors for the x y and z axes respectively this expands as follows f z y minus f y Z I plus F X Z minus F Z X J plus F Y X minus F X Y K display style left frac partial f underscore z partial y frac partial f underscore y partial z right math bf i plus left frac partial f underscore x partial z frac partial f underscore z partial x right math bf j plus left frac partial f underscore y partial x frac partial f underscore X partial y right math BF K 
Topic line integrals, surface integrals, and volume integrals For some scalar field f, u r n r, the line integral along a piecewise smooth curve c u is defined as c f d s equals a b f r t r t d t. Display style int limits underscore c f d s equals int underscore a caret b f math b f r t math b f r t d t, where r a b c is an arbitrary bijective parametrization of the curve c such that r a and r b give the endpoints of c and a b display style a for a vector field f u r n r n the line integral along a piecewise smooth curve c u in the direction of r is defined as c f r d r equals a b f r t r t d t display style int limits underscore c math b f f math b f r c d o t d math b f r equals int underscore a caret b math b f f math b f r T C D O T Math B F R T D T Where is the dot product and R A B C is a bijective parametrization of the curve C such that R A and R B give the endpoints of C. A surface integral is a generalization of multiple integrals to integration over surfaces. It can be thought of as the double integral analog of the line integral. To find an explicit formula for the surface integral, we need to parameterize the surface of interest, S, by considering a system of curvilinear coordinates on S, like the latitude and longitude on a sphere. Let such a parameterization be x S t, where S t varies in some region t in the plane. Then, the surface integral is given by S f d S equals T F X S T X S times X T D S D T Display style i i n t underscore s f mathrm d s equals i i n t underscore t f math b f x s t left partial math b f x over partial s times partial math b f x over partial t right mathrm d s mathrm d t where the expression between bars on the right-hand side is the magnitude of the cross-product of the partial derivatives of x s, t, and is known as the surface element. Given a vector field v on s, that is a function that assigns to each x in s a vector v x, the surface integral can be defined component-wise according to the definition of the surface integral of a scalar field, the result is a vector. A volume integral refers to an integral over a three-dimensional domain. It can also mean a triple integral within a region d in R3 of a function f x y z and is usually written as d f x y Z D X D Y D Z Display style I I I N T limits underscore D F X Y Z D X die D Z Topic Fundamental theorem of line integrals The fundamental theorem of line integrals, says that a line integral through a gradient field can be evaluated by evaluating the original scalar field at the endpoints of the curve. Let phi u r n r display style var phi u subset ek math b r caret n to math b r then Phi 
q minus phi p equals gamma p q phi r d r Display style var phi left math bf q right var phi left math bf p right equals int underscore gamma math bf p math bf q nabla var phi math bf r c d o t d math bf r. Topic Stokes theorem. Stokes' theorem relates the surface integral of the curl of a vector field f over a surface sigma in Euclidean 3 space to the line integral of the vector field over its boundary sigma. Sigma times f d sigma equals sigma f d r. Display style i i n t underscore sigma nabla times math b f f c d o t mathrm d math b f sigma equals oint underscore partial sigma math b f f c d o t mathrm d math b f r. Topic: Divergence theorem. Suppose V is a subset of R n display style math b r caret n in the case of n topic 3 V represents a volume in 3D space which is compact and has a piecewise smooth boundary S also indicated with V S. If f is a continuously differentiable vector field defined on a neighborhood of V, then the divergence theorem says V f d v equals display style i i i n t underscore v left math b f nabla c d o t math b f f right d v equals S display style script style s f n d s display style math b f f c d o t math b f n d s the left side is a volume integral over the volume 5, the right side is the surface integral over the boundary of the volume 5. The closed manifold V is quite generally the boundary of V oriented by outward pointing normals, and N is the outward pointing unit normal field of the boundary V. Donations may be used as a shorthand for NDS. In topology Three-dimensional space has a number of topological properties that distinguish it from spaces of other dimension numbers. For example, at least three dimensions are required to tie a knot in a piece of string, with the space R 3 The topologists locally model all other three manifolds. Topic. See also Dimensional analysis Distance from a point to a plane Skew lines section distance Three-dimensional graph Notes <laughs>